great. Um, yeah, so what is this run? I think this, here I'm level 32 already and I have all kinetic weapons. I think I'm the gunner. Yeah, I'm a gunner. I have all kinetic weapons. Two of them are heavy. So I have a mini gun and this one is new and I want to bring it to level 12 to unlock the overclocks, right? And yeah, feels strong, feels powerful. And I think it's two more maps and then we would beat the Dreadnought and then I would also... Yeah, this would be the first time in this biome. So wish me luck, right? Uh, yeah, I was in the shop, I bought all the upgrades and then I had to stop. So if I press continue, we will land on the next map, one map before the Dreadnought. And uh, it's the second difficulty, Hazard Level 2. It's tough, but I got really good upgrades. I was lucky with legendary upgrades, epic upgrades and so on. So we'll see how it goes. Goat. Your mission is clear. Get to it. We have to collect mushrooms. Okay, I see one already. I'm now... So I played a lot yesterday. I'm totally addicted to this game. I mean, the first thing I did this morning, I started up the game when I, mean, I had my coffee. <laughs> so, um, and yeah, now I, I try to always focus on this basically side quest. Uh, the first thing I do, right, I land and I try to collect the mushrooms or get the um, more kite or what is it, pick the flowers. And then afterwards, I'm just collecting gold and nitro, right? And then, and then there is the supply pot that I al also always try to get. So that's a good, I guess, order, right? Because sometimes if you focus on harvesting resources first, um, sometimes you wouldn't manage, you wouldn't be able to manage to drop the supply pot or you wouldn't manage to get your side quest done, right? Maybe uh, you don't find the more kite because it's really getting tougher over time, right? In the beginning, it's chill and you can do the side quest. But if you wait too long, then it's just getting too tough. Yeah. And yeah, as I said, right, this weapon, I want to unlock the overclocks. It's a new weapon that I just got. How is it called? Thunderhead Heavy Auto Cannon. And it's really cool. Uh, it shoots a barrage of exploding projectiles in one direction and it doesn't say it's somewhere here but when I saw it in some other menu it was telling um, that it is focusing on the strongest enemy that is in range which is also quite cool right it's basically a boss killer weapon right Oh, but it kills everything, but it's uh, very helpful against the boss too. So yeah, this the the mini gun is is not that nice for the boss, right? Because uh, you have to face the boss. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh, baby. Find those mushrooms. Where are they? By the way, yeah, the gunner, not the driller. Oh, wait, let's check here. Oh, have I had this grenade with you yesterday? I also have this grenade. I think I unlocked it in the evening without you guys. I have a grenade that shoots bullets. It's really cool. I like it. It's basically both, right? A grenade and, uh, and the gun. Really nice. Some pie. Okay, look at this. Already get going crazy. Uh oh. Die. I need the mushrooms. Mushroom here, mushroom there. Nice. I need two more. One more. Oh, nice. There it is. Bam. Objective completed. Excellent job. Excellent job. I think so too. Which one do I pick? Armor to survive longer? 
Yeah. I'll take this one. Oh. Oof. Did they drop the supply pot already? Yeah. I don't see any supply pot on the minimap. Think you can kill me? Think again. Too much crap in the way. Supplies can't land. Yeah. Okay. There's the supply. Oh shit. This will help me work harder. Overclock fire damage? No, I don't want fire damage. Doubles your armor while weapon is reloading. This is kind of cool. Put a bit of extra kick in it. Swarm detected. Get ready to me with the show. Yes! So cool. So so nice. Come on, shoot bitch! Um. I'm raring to try this out. Now I'm squishing so many again. Oh god, this is gonna be good. Good work. Oh. <laughs> Such a nice game. I am a dick and I'm dwarfing a hole. Diggy diggy hole. Diggy diggy hole. Standing still, I usually don't do this, right? By the way, I still couldn't manage to do this. The standing still challenge. Do we have the golden tip bullets? We have them. So then I want more gold to deal more damage, basically. I'll take it. Wow, this is so awesome. Legendary, 40% fire rate to all projectile weapons. This GG. My whole life better. This is nuts. Pretty sweet. This one looks best. Oh, there's the boss. Eat this boss, eat this. Should we bring this to overclock 3 or should we bring this to overclock 1? I feel like we bring this to overclock Surprise, 3 first. I'll take this one. Mm, all the experience. Awesome. This is 10% for each weapon, right? This is too good to not take it. This is perfect for my build. Yeah, you can see my firepower, right? This is why I didn't want to abandon this run. I have an incredible firepower in this run. Yes, now we can pick this one. Power of my kin courses through me. Pico magazines versus reload shield. Yeah, I kind of because I think the minigun isn't dealing too much of our damage. I think I'm going for the armor. Ah, fuck it. Let's take increase the clip size. Um, yeah, let's increase the clip size. I changed my mind. <laughs> Okay, maybe we can... We have so much firepower, right? We just... Maybe we can find some resources. Move on. It's worse down there. Uh oh. Nice. Look at this. Mm. Don't see anything on the map. No gold, no, no nitro. The bugs are all over you. Ah, the bugs are not an issue. Don't cry. Whoa, fifteen percent. Lock it in. Quota satisfied. The drop pod is arriving. Get moving. Whoa. We hang around.
Let's kill them. I don't know. I don't think this is doing a lot. So I'm going. Even if it's just two percent, I'm going for move speed. Gather up your beard and get onto that drop pod. It's about to leave. Okay. Okay. Stage four is done. Onwards to stage five. Nice. We go. And this was, and I think now we are fighting the boss. I think now it's boss time. Reload speed for the pistol. Which, well, what is also really cool is with this build, I have one overclock for this weapon that makes the shots um, apply knockback. And I really like, like knockback is so helpful in this game. Whenever I see knockback somewhere, I'm basically picking it. It's so good, right? Just keep the bugs away from you, right? Sometimes um, you just need this little gap, right? To Basically, you have 10,000 monsters on both sides and, uh, and you want to go kind of through them. <laughs> and uh, sometimes it's this little bit of knockback that is helping you through. Otherwise, they would just, yeah, they would just run you over and you're dead. Like knockback really makes a difference there. Cowabunga! On this one, I guess can only take one of those two. I really want to unlock the upgrades for this one. Hell yeah! And then Surely we reroll. Next time will be better. Ooh, a two rare ones. Ooh, shit! I wish I could pick this. I could try to reroll and get a gold upgrade for this one, right? But I guess. On the boss map, I also get an opportunity to get one more level for this. And 10% more damage for all weapons and 35 more maximum hit points. Then we have almost 300. We will definitely beast the boss. I'm gonna go with this. Good. Let's do that. Here we go. You found the Dreadnought. Now you just need to make it come out of hibernation by destroying the cocoons. Show them what a single dwarf can do. That hit the spot. It's kind of funny how they always send you alone, right? <laughs> uh, and they're always like putting stress on this, right? They really, they always tell you Just want to talk to that they send you alone. Like, yeah, there's this super nasty dreadnought. It's a huge threat, but... Anyways, we sent you alone. You can do it, right? Oh shit, what am I doing here? Good, we need to open the, the cocoons, guys. Here, there is one. Oh, look at this, crazy. See this? The knockback? It's amazing. The fly can't even touch us. So cool. And this time you have just more time, right? For mining and... Uh, because everything is being knockbacked. You don't see these every day. Wow, look at this. Crazy. Go your life, huh? I'm gonna be the best survivor. Good. Good job. Can't really happy. I think this yet. weapon rocks. A pop to loop on. Let's get the middle. This heavy weapon with explosive projectiles, hello. Explosive projectiles must be the best kind of weapon ever invented. Together with this grenade, which is also a gun, right? A gun grenade is also so clever. And we squished another boss. Uh, let me pick the upgrade. I'll take this one. Jade is here. Oh, shit, I'm eating all those projectiles. 
this firepower is so cool and this this you usually don't have with the damage over time builds right with fire damage and acid damage so i'm still in the end i'm still a huge fan of a huge fan of the projectile weapons honestly but it's all fun Good. That, 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 that. I smoked them, exactly. And this is why I couldn't abandon this run, right? If it wouldn't, if it would be an average run, I would have said fuck it, right? Abandon. But I freaking smoked them, it feels so good. And I hope we can beat the Dreadnoughts with this build. Oh shit, there he is. Just have to be careful. I don't think I have a lot of movement speed, but it seems to be enough. This Malaka boss. Oh, nice. I found a magnet. Oh, shit. I was stuck and the boss is charging me. Need it. Oh, good. Take that. Nice. Yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> Ooh, that looks scary. Yeah, blow them up. Blow them up when this Malaka boss is there. I gotta move on. It's getting worse down there. Uh oh. Geil. Trust Geil, right? Delete that thing. Ah, I hope we can do it. It's really getting tougher over time. By a lot. We notice quickly how all of the sudden, even, even the small bugs are pretty, um, what's the word, sturdy. Uh, hard to kill. Uh, pff, critical chance over critical damage, I guess. Back it in. Boy, feel for the lies. See how they are hard to kill, even the small ones? Oh. Don't get this wrapped up soon, it's all over, <laughs> Nice, but we have so much health left. Come on, fuck him. <laughs> oh shit, oh no, he hit me. Kill him! Kill him! The bugs are going insane! Move! Oh gosh, he hit me again! Kill this fucker! Yes! Oh oh, but now we have to get back home. Oh my god, that was awesome. Oh! Do you see how do you see how the knockback just saved my ass? This huge knockback that I this is a, a relic that I have. It just saved my ass, otherwise this swarm of bugs would have killed me. I'm, a new I'm just leaving, I'm just leaving, I'm scared. Congratulations. You did it, right? To worry about. Management sends their regards. <sighs> what a nice run. And I get a salty pretzel! This is the best reward I could imagine. A salty pretzel.
50 armor I reached. Ooh, that I that I mean the the boss. I I actually did a bad job, right? The boss got me twice. The damage that the boss deals is sick, but apparently we had 50 armor. That's why it didn't kill us, and we had a lot of hit points too. Wow, can now be found during a dive. Mmm, and what does it do? We don't know. Overclock unlocked. Bam. 7.7 .7 million almost. And look at this. This Thunderhead, although it didn't have overclocks, did the most damage with the exploding projectiles, right? I had the feeling that this weapon is amazing. And basically now we see the numbers. It did more damage than our main weapon, the Bulldog. Um, yeah, just great. Happy that I have the overclocks for it now. Very nice.